Hello students. Welcome to EduFarm. Believe and become classes for GPAT and NIPER JEE. Like, share, subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell icon to get further notifications. Hello students. Welcome to another video by EduFarm, your one-stop solution to GPAT and NIPER. Today's lecture is on hydrophilic, lipophilic balance, classification, some important HLV values and some questions which are important and from the previous years. Before we begin, I would like you to answer to a poll. The link is mentioned in the card above. Choose a topic on which you would like our next video to be on. Now let's begin. Now with the overview, the hydrophilic lipophilic balance of a surfactant is a measure of the degree to which it is hydrophilic or lipophilic, determined by calculating values for the different regions of the molecule. HLV scale was developed by Griffin in the year 1949. HLV values are calculated for non-ionic surfactants only. The HLV value is an indication of the solubility of the surfactant. Each surfactant has a hydrophilic group and a lipophilic group. The hydrophilic group is usually a polyhydric alcohol or ethylene oxide. The lipophilic group is usually a fatty acid or a fatty alcohol. The range of HLV value lies from 1 to 20. Now emulsification with surfactants. Suppose we have an oil filled beaker and we want to add some water molecules to it to make a mixture but as water is not soluble in oil the mixture is immiscible but when we add surfactants to it the hydrophilic head attaches to the water molecule and the hydrophobic tail remains on the oil phase slowly the micelle formation occurs and the water molecule becomes soluble in the oil making it water by oil emulsion Similarly, if we have a water filled beaker and we add oil droplets to it, it will be immiscible. But as soon as we add surfactants to it, the micelle formation occurs with hydrophobic tail being submerged in the oil and hydrophilic head in the water phase. The micelle formation occurs forming an O by W emulsion. Now this is the HLV scale which is of the range of 0 to 20. On the left hand side we have from 11 to 20 the hydrophilic or lipophobic range. Then from 0 to 6 we have the lipophilic or hydrophobic range and in the middle from 7 to 10 we have the water dispersible phase. On the right hand side from 8 to 16 we have the O by W emulsifying agents. Then from 3 to 6 we have the W by O emulsifying agents. Again from 16 to 20 we have solubilizing agents. From 13 to 15 we have detergents. From 7 to 9 we have wetting and spreading agents. From 0 to 3 we have anti-forming agents. Now here are some important HLV values of some emulsifying agents. These are important in every exam and the questions uh, at the back of this video are related to this part also. Now first Amarcol or L101 Acacia which have the HLV value of 8. Then Sorbitan Monolaurate which has a value of 8.6. Sorbitan Monostearate which has a value of 4.7. Polysorbate 20 or Twin 20 has the HLV value of 16.7. Polysorbate 60 or twin 60 has the HLV value of 14.9. Polysorbate 80 or twin 80 has the HLV value of 15. Next, sodium lauryl sulfate SLS. Here comes the exception with an HLV value of 40. Sodium oleate has an HLV value of 18. Tragacanth has an HLV value of 13.2. Triethanolamine oleate has an HLV value of 12. 
पॉलीऑक्सीथिलीन लोडाई लिथर और ब्रिज थर्टी हैज द वैल्यू नाइन पॉइंट सेवन जेलाटीन हैज अ वैल्यू ऑफ नाइन पॉइंट एट क्राइटॉन एक्स फोर्टी फाइव हैज एन एच एल बी वैल्यू टेन पॉइंट फोर मिथाइल सेल्यूलोज हैज द वैल्यू टेन पॉइंट फाइव क्राइटॉन एक्स हंड्रेड हैज द एच एल बी वैल्यू थर्टीन पॉइंट फाइव पॉलीऑक्सीथिलीन मोनोस्टियरेट और मेज फोर्टी फाइव हैज द एच एल बी वैल्यू इलेवन पॉइंट वन नाउ हियर आर द सम फॉर्मूलाज विच आर यूज टू फॉर्मुलेट और कैलकुलेट द एच एल बी वैल्यू फर्स्ट वन इज एच एल बी इज इक्वल टू हाइड्रोफिलिक ग्रुप नंबर माइनस एन टाइम्स लिपोफिलिक ग्रुप नंबर प्लस सेवन द सेकेंड वन इज एच एल बी इक्वल टू ई प्लस फाइव ई प्लस पी बाई फाइव वेयर ई इक्वल टू परसेंटेज बाई वेट ऑफ इथिलीन ऑक्साइड चेन एंड पी इज इक्वल टू परसेंटेज बाई वेट ऑफ पॉलीहाइड्रिक एल्कोहल थर्ड फॉर्मूला विच इज एच एल बी इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी इन टू वन माइनस एस बाई ए वेयर एस इज द सेपोनिफिकेशन वैल्यू ऑफ एस्टर एंड ए इज द एसिड वैल्यू ऑफ फैटी एसिड फोर्थ फॉर्मूला विच इज द रिक्वायर्ड एच एल बी मिक्सचर वैल्यू दैट इज फ्रैक्शन ऑफ एच एल बी ए प्लस वन माइनस फ्रैक्शन ऑफ एच एल बी वी नॉ द फिफ्थ एंड फाइनल फॉर्मूला इज क्यू एस इक्वल टू सिक्स इन टू रो एस बाई रो बाई टेन माइनस जीरो पॉइंट फाइव इन टू रिक्वायर्ड एच एल बी प्लस फोर क्यू बाई थाउजेंड वेर क्यू एस इज द अमाउंट इन ग्राम्स ऑफ सरफेक्टेड मिक्सचर रिक्वायर्ड टू फॉर्म सोल्यूशन और इमल्शन रो एस द डेंसिटी ऑफ सरफेक्टेड मिक्सचर ग्राम पर क्यूबिक सेंटीमीटर रो इज द डेंसिटी ऑफ द डिस्पर्स्ड फेस ग्राम पर सेंटीमीटर क्यूब क्यू इज द परसेंटेज ऑफ कॉन्टीन्यूअस फेस नाउ हियर आर सम इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन दीज आर फ्रॉम द ईयर्स प्रीवियस ईयर्स ऑफ जी पैट आई विल गिव यू फाइव सेकेंड टाइमर आफ्टर ईच क्वेश्चन यू विल ट्राई टू आंसर द क्वेश्चन एंड देन आई विल गिव द आंसर सो लेट्स बिगिन एच एल बी सिस्टम इज यूज टू क्लासीफाई ऑप्शन वन सरफेक्टेंट्स ऑप्शन बी प्रिजर्वेटिव ऑप्शन सी एंटी ऑक्सीडेंट्स एंड ऑप्शन डी सिक्वेस्टेरिंग एजेंट्स नाउ पॉज द वीडियो एंड ट्राई टू आंसर द क्वेश्चन द करेक्ट आंसर इज सरफेक्टेंट्स नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर टू द एच एल बी वैल्यू ऑफ सोडियम लोडाइल सल्फेट एस एल एस इज ऑप्शन ए सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव ऑप्शन बी थर्टीन पॉइंट एट ऑप्शन सी ट्वेंटी फाइव and option d 40 pause the video again and try to answer it yes the correct value is 40 now question 3 polysorbate 80 or you can say twin 80 have hlb value of this question appeared in the in this year's west bengal pxc pharmacist exam so this is a very important question and as in the current years the questions from hlb value are coming which makes this topic an important topic for future exams also option a 3.8 option b 16.7 option c 15 and option d 13.2 now pause the video and try to answer the question hope you all have answered the question correctly and the answer is yes option c that is 15 Now the next question HLB value of tragacanthes this question appeared in GPAT 2018 option A 4.7 option B 8.7 option C 13.2 and option D 14.3 try to answer the question yes hope you all got the right answer which is option C 13.2 now here is a numerical from previous year questions that is of 2019 the question is a mixture of emulsifier a and emulsifier b with hlb values of 4 and 14 respectively are to be mixed in a por- proportion to get a mixture with required hlb of 12 what is the weight of the individual emulsifier that has to be taken to have a total weight of 7 g the options are given as 5.8 and 1.2 gram 1.4 and 5.6 gram 5.6 and 1.4 gram 1.2 and 5.8 gram 
Now pause the video. I will give you a timer of say 15 seconds to try the try this numerical. Pause the video and try it. Okay. I hope you all got it. You all have done the question and got the right answer. Now let's look at the solution. The solution will be done by allegation method. And if you want to know more about allegation method, the link is given in the card above. You can check the link to know more about this method. So we have emulsifier B, which is the highest value, 14, and emulsifier A below, which has the lowest value, 4. And the required value is 12. So when we subtract 14 from 12, we get two parts of A, emulsifier A, and when we subtract or 12 by emulsifier A, that is 4, we get 8 parts of B. So now, therefore, 10 parts are in total. From emulsifier A, we get 2 by 10 into 7, that is 1.4 gram of A, and then from emulsifier B, we get 8 by 10 into 7, that is 5.6 gram of B. So, combining to a total weight of 7 gram. Hope you all got the answer correct, which is option B. A is equal to 1.4 gram and B is equal to 5.6 gram. Now, that's all for today's video. Thank you. Stay home and stay safe. Help people in need. Thank you. Stay tuned to watch more videos like this. See you in the next video.